Hey guys, and welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. Um, it's kind of late today. It is 11.21. I had a lion, which is very naughty. But at least I'm up. Um, I needed that sleep because I was just so tired. So I decided to sleep in. And what I'm going to do today is I'm only going to have two cups of teas. The tea is making me stay up, so I thought... And I'm, I stopped having tea at 8 o'clock last night, and that's too... Uh, too too late because um, I go to bed. No, I want to go to bed at ten. So what I've decided is I'm gonna. Um, I wrote it down actually. Self, self, very self care. Okay, lots of um, water. Uh, basically, <laughs> I'd only. I want to limit myself to two cups of tea, two or three cups of tea in the morning to wake myself up, and then I'll drink a bunch of water throughout the day, and then a hot chocolate at nine p.m. or something. So. That's what I originally um, wanted to do. Um, so we're going to continue that today and then hopefully I might have to be up a bit later but um, let me... Sorry, I'm um, googling something. Because uh, basically... Um, Right. I'm just can try to calculate something. Okay, that's actually not that bad. Uh... Right, so basically I was I'm gonna get to try and get some stuff done today. Um, I'm hoping I could get up to test nine done. We'll see. Um because I don't like working when it's dark, but I think I'm just going to push past it and just keep going. Um, which is easier said than done. Um, because Rose is going to be here tomorrow and I still haven't unpacked. But what I'm going to do is I have two huge, do you, I think it's only two, but maybe three, huge um, bags from Home Bargains, like the huge ones. So anything that can't be put away that I want to keep is going to go in those bags. And then eventually when there's enough room, I'll be able to put them away because I've just got too much stuff. I need more like storage and I know once once I know where things are going then I'll be able to unpack more. Uh, it's just um, <laughs> I've got a lot of stuff to unpack so that's what I'm going to do later after all this is done because Rose is going to be here tomorrow and I want to sit on the settee. She can't let the one because there's boxes everywhere so that is what I'm trying to do uh, which I can which I can start as soon as well this is done. Um, I'm hoping to get it done today. It's one of my big goals. I want it done today. Whether it happens or not is another question. Also, um, I think you guys have heard me ramble around about April next year. I, it's highly unlikely that it's going to be having basically virus, um, obviously my weight and money as well. So um, me, and Michael, me and my boyfriend have agreed like not to wait, uh, not April next year, but it will be next year sometime. And I've chosen a day. I'm not going to tell anyone and obviously I'm not going to tell him until it's confirmed because I don't want to say hey I'm going to visit on this day and then months later actually it might not be able to happen because an issue has propped up so as soon as I buy the flight well I'm, as soon as I'm able to buy the flight tickets I tell them and then ask if it's okay and if it's okay then I'll book him because otherwise I'm just going to keep booking and rebooking and it's just not, it's not fair so um, it should be next year. I'm hoping, I've got everything focused on next year so we'll see um so yeah i'm i'm really hoping because it's it's, it's it would have been waiting for like two years now and it's not fair on him well two years in april so it's not really fair on him so yeah i'm trying my best <laughs> like everything was set to go in april this year like everything like i had the money i had everything and then the whole world is shut down so yeah in the future if I'm getting a car I'm looking to how long it actually driving it's a 24 hour drive so it'll take around uh, I'd say a day or so because obviously you'd have to stop but um, if I had a car I'd be able to drive there because I don't like layovers I don't like layovers and if I go there I have to have a layover so be which I'm really scared about I guess the way that's way to say it because obviously it's a new country um even as like a layover in Italy but with everything going on at the moment I was like I don't know what's happening so um yeah so we'll, we'll see 
because it is a 1,403 mile drive. So, yeah, <laughs> I was meant to whistle, but it just happened. So, yeah, that's what we're kind of dealing with. Um, so, we'll, we'll see. Hopefully, but we, we don't know, so yeah i've got my eyes set on on a particular date next year and i'm gonna keep work towards that i'm gonna work towards the, the aim in mind i'm going that date um we'll just have to see uh, <laughs> i decided because it's annoying that he has to wait and i'm like i'm so sorry i still feel so guilty uh, but it's my fault anyway for not for being vulnerable and stuff like that so oh well um so yeah i'm gonna crack on with work and that's what this stuff done I think that's what really annoys me um I woke up in a bad mood just because I knew I slept in um I was up at half five like I was like my alarm goes off at six I'll stay up no I fell back asleep and I put my music on the loud but it just nope fell back asleep so that's nice um so I'm kind of annoyed about that but so I need to learn my lesson to not turn the alarm off whatsoever so yeah, I didn't get out of bed until like ten. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what time it was. Um uh, probably be on here, but I was like sitting around for hours and yeah. You <laughs> see that's why if I got something to do, I don't like having a lion, so yeah, it's a bit of a pain in the bottom. So yes, um Yeah, so um, I get my food bank parcels tomorrow, which I'm happy about. Um, I've got a spag bowl to make later. So um, I'm going to try and get... My goal is to get at least six hours on the day. Because that's what I'm supposed to be doing. But I'm also supposed to catch up. So realistically, I should be doing 12 hours of studying a day. To catch up for two days. And I'm like, that's not possible. So what I'm thinking is saying six hours per day. Well, if I'm doing the other thing, then it might be easier. But... Um, and about six hours a day and then every day including the weekends because like i would only be having um two hours at the weekend so maybe i don't know we're just gonna keep going and try and get everything sorted 